Hello everyone, my name is Jamie. Welcome to Border Bananas and to my 13th Fun Finds Friday video. So this week I have Walmart, Dollar Tree, and Goodwill. And I got some fun things. I'm really excited. Okay, so at Walmart I'm going to start there first because I only got two things. I recently watched a video from the Frugal Farmhouse. She picked up this pinstripe dress from um, the time, brand Time and True, and I thought it was gorgeous, and I wanted to see if they had one in just a chambray version, and they did, so I ordered it. And it just looks like this. It is just this chambray button-down neck with that sleeve you guys know that I love so much. Now, why are we so dark again? Weird, okay. It says it's okay, I'm gonna trust it. <laughs> um, so it looks like this, um, and it's T-length, so it goes just below my knees. Now, this dress is gorgeous from the waist up. It has pockets, and I'm a curvy girl. I've got a badonkadonk, so these pockets look terrible on me. <laughs> they just make me look so wide at the bottom um, and I'm very sad because when I ordered it it didn't come with a tag there is no tag on this so I don't think I can return it so I might have to do a DIY with it maybe um, and make it a little more fitted or something at the bottom I don't know but um, it looks so cute from the waist up so I think I'm going to have to do something with this dress. Um, kind of sad that it doesn't have the, the hang tag. It's a bunch of baloney. Okay. So the second thing I purchased was the only thing I have purchased for spring, like true spring decor um, this year. And it is this little, uh, what would you call this? Candy dish maybe? with a little pink bird. I always try to add a little bit of pink into my decor in the springtime. And I currently have it in my um, coffee bar. It has my stevia in there. Looks like this. Hopefully you can see that. So yeah, I think this little guy's really cute. Okay, so that's it from Walmart. I'm gonna jump into Dollar Tree. I found some cute things. I'm going to start with this. I got this faith sign. I've never seen these at my Dollar Tree before. My Dollar Tree is really tiny, um, and I thought this was cute. Uh, I might do something with it. I don't know, because um, I think it looks a little plain and small like this. So unless I can find a good spot for it, I um, might try to change this up a bit. Then I picked up three bunches of the lavender. I was looking for this at my Walmart. My Walmart doesn't have it. They're just now putting out their spring and Easter decor. So they do have a spot for it, but there isn't any there. So um, maybe I'll get that too. But um, so I just grabbed a few of these from the Dollar Tree. I uh, three of them. Then I got a few craft supplies just to revamp my stock. I'm out of this dry foam for uh, floral arrangements, so I grabbed one of those. And then I grabbed the multi-pack of sandpaper. My son is always raiding my sandpaper discs for my palm sander, <laughs> so he could sand and do like little things with his max matchbox cars and stuff. Um, he likes to take them apart and rebuild them. <laughs> so uh, I grabbed some of these. It'll be great for DIY projects as well. And then also just replenish my supply. I'll probably get a few more packs of these, but this is the eight pack of the foam brushes. And um, yeah. So then something that I haven't seen before are these little glass vases. They're so cute. They look like this. And I had never seen, seen these before. Uh, and neither had the cashier, the lady that was working there, so I think they might be new, but I got three of them because I thought they would be super cute as um, a centerpiece. Um, just lined up in a row on the table, or um, they, they would even be cute if you flipped them upside down or kept them right side up. I don't know, I kind of like them flipped upside down. For a pedestal, super cute DIY. Ideas for those little guys. So that's what I got at Walmart and Dollar Tree. Okay, so now I'm gonna go through um, my Goodwill finds. I've got a few 
things here. I got just a few things for my daughter Josie. I went on Thursday, it's half off kids day on Thursday. I'll show you what I got for her. These shorts were $3.99, so I paid $2 for them. They are the So brand, so they are from um, Kohl's, and they're just in her size for this summer, which is nice because she needs shorts very badly. Last summer she had so many, and this summer she doesn't have, I think she has one pair. So that is a welcome addition. Then I also picked her up this uh, Faded Glory tank top. It's super cute, looks brand new, like it had never been used. Just a flounce, flouncy, flowy white tank top. I think she's really going to like that. Now this one is in the next size up. This is a size 13, 14. It's Amber, Crom uh, Amber Crombie Kids, or Abercrombie Kids, however you want to say it, but it is just a white little button up sleeveless top and it has little pin, pink pinstripes with flamingos on it. I thought that was super cute. And then this is a three-quarter sleeve. I don't know the brand because they, they took the tag out but it's also in the next size up I believe. Um, little shirt and I thought that would look so cute layered with this. Gorgeous, and it, yeah, I said that. I didn't know the brand, right? Okay, it was $3.99, so I paid $2 for it. Then this next brand is Cherokee. It's from uh, Target. It was originally $1.99, and I paid a dollar for it. And another little cute little lightweight summer spring uh, sweater. And it is a size 10, 12, so that will fit her this year. And maybe next year. Okay, I bought my son Michael one thing. Yeah, I got him this Motley Crue t-shirt. It's an original band t-shirt. It has the logo or the TM, the trademark at the bottom. And it just looks like this, which is kind of funny because it is my husband's favorite. <laughs> uh, he, he wanted this for himself. I was like, there's no way that's fitting you, dude. Okay. And then I bought one thing for me and my spring capsule. I'm so excited about it because I've been looking for one for so long. And it is this camel suede military style. Oh, there goes my son, you guys. Military style jacket. Hold on. Boy, is that better? <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> okay. So it looks like this. Um, it was $8.99 with a pink tag, and it just, oh my gosh, I think it is so cute. I'll try it on for you. Um, let's see, can I do it right here? So it just looks like that. So cute. Um, love it. But I was super excited about this. I. When I was in high school, I used to wear a camel colored suede vest that I loved, wore all the time. It was very fitted, very cute. I'm so excited. <laughs> Wish I had that vest still. Okay, so next up, I will go on to this I have one wooden object, and I got this bad boy here. Got this vintage little stool. I think it is so cute. I have a thing for stools. It looks like I have a screw coming undone somewhere, or maybe that's just the way it was made. I don't know, but it has a little gap right here. Um, but I have a vision for this. I have a few stools that I've thrifted along the way, and um, I've seen on an Instagram page, and I can't remember where it was, but they have the stools stacked on top of each other and used them as a table. Um, and I want to do that in my entryway. I think it would be so cute. Um, so I'm, they're all painted in a relative fashion, but with different undertones. So I can't wait to do that with this. It's going to be so cute, I hope. Okay, next up, I already have one of these, but I've got this pewter goblet. And it looks like um, they're the same pewter goblets that I had bought last time. I have one on my hutch currently um, that I have a doily in. Um, but I had only bought one and there was three other ones. Well, I think somebody else bought the three other ones and brought them in because they all had little hang tags on them like they were for sale somewhere else. 
and nobody bought them so they just returned them and I was so excited to find them because I always wanted at least one more I only bought one more I could have bought all three of them and had four but I don't really need four but it would be nice to have a matching set so I grabbed another one of these and it was a dollar ninety nine now something very utilitarian I bought this what is it American Bluebird by Landmark made in China saucer I got this for my daughter um, she just recently turned 16 and for her 16th birthday my husband had bought her an orchid and um, a new terracotta pot to go under it um, to go to put it in I should say so I bought her this um, saucer it just looks like this uh, so she could use it as you know a, a to catch the drippage or you know water and her room is navy and like this minty teal color so this works perfectly and then I found a vintage false graph heritage collection creamer and I was so excited about this you guys it is so cool now false graph does still make the heritage collection but this one is in fact vintage it um, if they have the castle trademark at the bottom it is vintage so I was really excited to see this uh, I paid $2.99 for it so yeah and you guys know my love for pictures oh I just love them I've been loving and collecting pictures since I first got married in 2000 I have decluttered a bunch of them but I still love collecting my white ones so then next up I found this big guy he's big he's heavy he needs to be clean but I think he is gorgeous it is eight, it was $8.99 and I think this would look so cute right here on my fireplace it's a vase I just think it is so cool it has a watermark at the bottom I'm gonna try and get that out I think I can the top comes off let's see and it's corked on so it is airtight I don't know what else you would put in here other than flowers but it the other ones there were three of them and they were all different shapes and the other one said that they were made in Spain but you can see here it has a nice big corked lid there Ooh, the clouds are coming in let's see okay we're still good I think okay so um it, yeah it just nice big hole so I can put some flowers in there I'm thinking my pussy willow branches would look really cute in here on my uh, whatever you want to call it my fireplace <laughs> Whoa, losing words words are hard today okay last but not least I found this guy and this is just a wire rack I'm hoping you can see it it looks like there we go and it has the floral emblem in the middle it was $4.99 I thought this was really cool I see my soap dispensers in here with the stack of towels beside my sink um, it'd be cute with plants and cutting boards and all that good stuff and rolling pins and the farmhouse decor but it, I just love this thing I thought it was really cool and that my friends is what I got this week for my fun finds Friday don't forget to head over to Instagram and follow me over there that's where I do all my thrift with me videos every Thursday sometimes Wednesday if I'm feeling extra frisky <laughs> uh, and thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe as well and give this video a thumbs up uh, so I can keep continuing to make future fun find Fridays videos thank you guys Mwah.